going to be teaching you how to make a fishtail fireball bracelet. And here's up close. Just using red and orange. So let's get started. But before I get started, um, you'll be needing some clips. Um, just a clip. And then um, orange and red rubber bands. And I'll be showing you a comparison this to the one I'm going to make now. Okay, and just one more thing. So subscribe, like, and comment. And we're going to be doing vlogs on here. Probably I'm going to do a vlog today, like 10 to 15 minutes. And this one will take about 5 minutes if I hurry up and don't spend 15 minutes talking and talking. So let's get started. I'm going to make a small bracelet. This is probably all the bands that you'll need. Matter of fact, I'm probably just going to make a ring. Just to like, so I show you how to make it. So FR. So R stands for red, of course. So I'm going to start it with red. So you first you just want to cross it like this. Very easy. Just twist. Boom. Put it on your middle and pointer finger. Pointer and middle. Sorry about that. And um, you just want to put, um, so it's basically red, orange, red, orange. Until you get three, I'm going to show you the next step. So basically, you just want to have one orange in the middle. See, one orange in the middle. And two reds on the bottom and top. So you want to take this bottom one, loop it over. This bottom one, and loop it over. Then you want to kind of separate these because these are way, 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 way too close together. And then you just want to take a orange orange. So it's basically going to be red, orange, red, orange. And you're basically just going to be looping the two bottom, two, um, the bottom one, um, the, the side, one side loop and the other side loop on the bottom. So this time I'm going to be looping red instead of orange. So you just want to loop and loop. I'll show you the finished product. I would recommend like pulling it down every time you get done looping from the bottom because you don't want them to get too close to, to each other or too close to the top because it could fall off and you just mess up and have to start all over again. Now if you want to make a bracelet, it would probably take 10 minutes and a necklace probably would take 15 minutes. So like the longer, the longer like increases five more minutes. So yeah, if you want to make a necklace. So the reason, um... I say use two colors because if you like get off like get off track and you like don't know what the pattern is and like it's just going to be a hot mess using like blue, purple, green and all that stuff. Um, orange and red look very much alike and I just like put three, two reds uh, like on like in a row and like one um, orange on top. So since they look very alike it probably most likely won't be it won't look too bad so now once you're done with that you here's the part where you'll need your clip um you just basically like take this off put it all on one finger and then take that and then just like um like pick it all up from that one finger and clip it on there clip on there and this takes me a little while to clip it on so I'm just gonna pause. Then basically what you wanna do is find a rubber band on the other side and clip it. And there's your ring and yeah and um go check out my vlog vlog um not vlog channel. Go check out my blog for today. I'll just start doing vlog this stuff and this fell apart. So I'm gonna Clip it again, and I'm going to let you watch me clip this, how much trouble I have with it. There we go. And it's just going to clip. You know what? I'm throwing this in the dumpster. I'm putting this in my jewelry box. Hopefully, you will see me vlog. And go check out my other YouTube channels. And yeah, bye.